Lee SDRT. Subscribe now. Oh, subscribe now. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. And as you guys know, you already guys already know the situation Yaya got herself into a couple days ago. So, and now she's reportedly facing 99 years in prison for stabbing the girl that young boy was with. A lot of people are saying how this is fake because you can't get 99 years for stabbing somebody with a butter knife. But then other people are talking about how it doesn't matter that she stabbed her with a butter knife. It's, it was the intention she, intention she had behind it and how... And also how in Texas, they don't play that. So that's why it's 99 years. But it doesn't mean how she's getting 99 years. It just means at most, she could be put in prison is for 99 years. So she could really get like a year or two. But at the uh, most amount of years she could get is 99. But yeah, so we'll see how this, how this goes down. I got a little reading right here from College Kids on Instagram. So shout out to them. It says, Ayana Mayweather, a.k.a. Yaya, has obtained the legal services of Jay Prince's attorney, Kurt Schaffer, to represent, to represent her. Yaya is accused of stabbing NBA Youngway's baby mama, Lapacha Jacobs. They're still calling her his baby mama. I'm pretty sure she's not, but who cares, really? But let's go. She's all right. She's all right, though. So She faces a charge of felony aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. Yaya could be facing up to 99 years in prison. And a ten thousand dollar fine, which is like a dollar to her daddy, so that means nothing. Shaffrey confirmed that Yaya plans to plead not guilty when she returns to court in August. So you guys know this whole virus situation. They don't really want they're not really trying to put some extra people in jail. So that's the reason why she only had thirty K bail too. But yeah. And people was talking about how since she got Jay Prince's lawyer, it's e she's easily gonna beat the case. I don't really know too much about him, but is he some legendary lawyer or something? I don't know. Let me guy, let me know in the comments section. It was like, it's a wrap. The case is already over. I've seen some comments talking like that because they, she got Jay Prince's lawyer. I don't really know what too much will happen with Jay Prince, but informing in the comments is like his lawyer, some legendary guy or something, like the best lawyer out here. But yeah, so this is Yaya, update on Yaya's situation. She's facing 99 years, which doesn't mean she's getting 99 years. She could only get like a year or two. Something like that, 10, 15, 1, 2 years. Who knows? We'll see what happens. She returns to court in August, so we'll see what happens then. But yeah, um, I'll keep you guys updated with everything that's going on. If you haven't seen my video earlier today, make sure you guys go check that out. It was about Yaya's sister saying how young boy and Yaya is not married, but we already knew that. But still, go check the video out. And also, please leave a like because the more likes... Helps out the channel. That means they put it on other people's recommended. That's how the channel gets more viewers and more subscribers. So please leave a like. And everyone, please give me a follow on Instagram. Because at 1K followers, I'll be doing a $100 giveaway. And also a face reveal. So just please go follow me. And yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Daily SDRT. Daily SDRT. Daily SDRT. Daily SDRT. Daily SDRT. Daily SDRT. Subscribe now. Subscribe now. Hey guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Tune into our next video to stay updated with all the latest, latest tea going around. Please don't forget to co like, comment, share, and subscribe. And hit the bell so you receive notifications. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and have a great rest of your day. Videos will be coming your way daily. Also, my email is in the about section of my channel. And you can email me some tea that I missed. Or you can email me some tea that you want me to post.